Yeah, so far a very dry AOD hour, unfortunately. We're hoping that maybe this final kill will give us something special, but uh, I have some doubts. And there we go. And unfortunately, we are unlucky. It's an entire hour of AOD done, and uh, nobody got anything. So, uh, a bit of a disaster, but it happens. Oh, look at that, though. Another hour, and uh, yeah, 4.8k on the AOD uh, milestone charts there, so we are making progress, sort of, maybe. Please, I need a res. Oh, we got a codex! And then, wait, what happened? Where did my HP come from? Oh, I think I rezzed. He did pick it up, right? Yeah, I think we're good. Bit awkward. Still fine, I think. Oh, look at that. Another praise of Codex. Dude, we're making money this hour. That's two Codex drops. So very, very nifty so far. The hearts, nice. Coronet Grants. I've never, ever had a, uh, a double ECB piece. Not even one. All right, there we go. That's an AOD hour done. So thank you, team. And uh, yeah, we got two Codex drops as a team. So that's awesome. So uh, we're making bank at the moment. 75 more split for that double codex, pretty cool. So yeah, averaging one codex per hour today, so uh, definitely not bad. So uh, yeah, big money for necromancy for mainscape. So it depends on the thing. There we go, look at that. <laughs> it's so nice, isn't it? Just like smash, 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 beautiful. 100 bits, thank, thank you. Oh, I see green. I see green. Look at that. We have a, a drop for Jay on the old Raptor buff. Good luck, good luck. A. Ah, well. Raptor buff coming in real clutch, guys. Coming in great. Nice and clutch. That's just. Hooray. Woo. Oh my god, guys, it's done. It's done. It's actually done. It's done. I'm free. I don't have to go to Crow anymore. I don't have to go to Crow. I've got full crypt. I've got full crypt. Oh my god, I've got full crypt. I've got full crypt. I did screw this boss. I'm so. I am so glad that I'm done. I'm so glad that I'm done. Dude, I'm so happy. I'm so relieved. Dude, Zami pushing. We're, we're going to 4K, guys. We're going to 4K. <laughs> Oh, let's go, dude. Let's actually go. I have, oh, dude, I'm very, very, very happy about that. That is, oh my god. No more crow. No more crow ever again. Ever again. Oh, dude, this is the best. Dude, I, oh, I am happy. I am very, very happy right now. Believe it. I actually cannot believe it. Look at that. It's in there. It's in there. Crypt loop hell. I'm going to bank it before it disappears. There we go. Everything moved to the bank. Fantastic. So guys, here we go. The greatest moment. Something I've been working on for an unbelievably large amount of time. The Crypt loop hell. This is that when you have the whole set, the five piece, which I now have, um, it's that it's that fungal shield at the bottom there. It gives you like a 5k HP shield, which is insanely good for tanking one of Zami Auto's attacks on P7. Make, create. Oh, here we go. Here it is. Here it is. And there it goes. Oh, it's fantastic. So we can go out with the Acto and in with the Crypt Bloom. What we need now for best in slot on my little list is oh, it's just the Imperium Court. That's it. We're one item away. Although, arguably, I also need Decimation, Terrasol Maul, and Hex Hunter Bow, but we'll, uh, we'll see about those at some point, I guess. Raptor thingy, the final day, I think, uh, on Zami, on Mainscape, and we got nothing. The classic scan, exactly. Ah, well, <laughs> we lost a few well out of that, but it's fine. Got six rerolls left. Maybe I'll use them at some point. Who knows on Mainscape, but uh, yeah, we did not make any money from Raptor whatsoever. All right, I'm going to use the Iron's Raptor buff. Just going to dot Ambi because my setup right now is not the best. And unfortunately, a Raptor's favor faded away once again. Hey, there we go. Doing some AOD. It took us 54 minutes. But we've obtained a Praise of Codex as a team. Very nice, very nice. The Codex, I think they've, uh, they have started to go down a fair bit because I imagine... 
a lot of people doing AOD. So yeah, the prices of codexes have uh, yeah, plummeted <laughs> somewhat. Yo, dude, my first run of the day. Daily Barrows coming in clutch with a dupe, unfortunately. So unlucky. Toroxan, though. All right, here we go. This is the uh, the final kill of the second hour of AOD that we're doing today. So let's see anything cool. Nah, nothing. This. Oh, look at that! Back at Calfight King and sort. He got the wrong weapon, so he's a little bit unhappy, but unlucky. Ah, <laughs> wait! Somebody got another mace. <laughs> Well, goodbye to your loot share points, and uh, then let, let me guess, my turn for a sword next, or an offhand longsword specifically. Oh well. Hey, a perfect chitin, or chitin as it's apparently called. Uh, about time I got one of those, so we'll take that. Very nice. Wait, I just got back-to-back -back perfect, okay. Uh, that's cool. Like that, like one in fifty each. So technically, rarer than a pet drop to get back to back of that. <laughs> kind of interesting. Wait, I got another one. What? I've had three perfect chitins today, which is apparently called chitin. But I don't know. Chitin just sounds more like what the word looks like. So, yeah, interesting. Cool though. And more dwarf seeds. That's how uh, Snow White actually uh, came across those one day, and that's how the seven dwarves are born. It's uh, yep. Yeah. It's in, it's in the book. Yeah, pretty sure I did. Watch him green shield again now, wouldn't that be fun? Ah. Didn't actually, guys, I didn't actually mean for it. Okay, well, unlucky. And there we go, that should be Kalfa. Oh, got me about dead almost. I was going to say Kalfa King dead, but it turns out it was me the whole time. But there we go, that's how the kills look like. And there we go, that is the final kill of the Calphiteus Kinga's trip, and it's just sharks. That's kind of typical, isn't it, really? Typical sharks, but it's alright. Yeah, quite a momentous occasion right now. This is the first time I'll be using a full Crypt Bloom to uh, base tank raids with uh, with Twitch chat. Should be good fun. Oh wait. oh, wait, no, I had Insight on! Oh, no! I had insight on, I got smacked at 9 k oh, it's a disaster. <laughs> Dude, how did I, like, why didn't my crippling save me? Like, what's what's up with that, you know? Like, am I, I'm being, oh, dear, oh dear, trolled by my supposedly OP armor, like, what happened? Let's check Yakamaru, slight couple of accidents, but it's all good. The classic 8 minute many poor repeat Yaka, but it's, it's fine, we did it, and we got it first try. All right, what do we have from Mr. Beastmaster? An effigy. Do I get these all the time now, it seems? But unfortunately, got a reroll in case we get a Tuzzy chance. So let's see. Was it worth it? It was not worth it. Techie, let's see if the reroll will save us. Seeing a couple of codexes there, really cool. And hey, I got one too. Wait, 67? What happened to these things? Why are they so expensive? All right, and there we go. That's it. The first ever. Uh, full Crypt Bloom, Zami Solo, on this account. I gotta say, it was lovely, so let's do it again. This is gonna hurt a lot. Holy. Fungal Shield saving- wait, I could've killed the boss! I didn't realize- it, I didn't realize it was on a 15k, I could've killed it! So yeah, as we can see, Crypt Bloom, very useful when things go a bit wrong in P7 there, because the- like, the second rune took ages, so I was getting hit a lot of damage, and Fungal Shield saved me. Yeah, I am probably doomed. Um, unless Fungal Shield comes into play, let's go. Oh, we even got the uh, the crackling, I think, there, or something like that. But there we go, easy 50k damage after having a slight nightmare beforehand. And there it is, another one down. Oh, 1779 blood runes. Let's go. Big day, big, 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 big day indeed. We'll have that, absolutely. And hey, 300 Zami Solos. In crits, though. Ah, oh, yes, the, uh, the P1 fungal shield proc. Dude, that tanks so much, though, actually. Like, that was, it's nice. 
Wow, I had 99.3 adrenaline. I should have just auto attacked the demon. I tried to auto Zami, but I already, already ran away. That was kind of unfortunate, but thankfully, Ring of Death exists. What? No, 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 no. Oh my god. I can't believe it. My familiar just betrayed me. Please, 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 please. Oh my god. So yeah, I thought I called my familiar away from the rune, and apparently I didn't. And he killed it during my adren build. That was so lucky that I still had a sign left. Oh my god. I just did an hour of Zami and I didn't have Death Ward on. So I took like way more damage than I was supposed to. But I completely forgot. Again, why am I like this? There we go. Bit of a Virgo. Holy moly. We're making bank today, guys. Some Torstor Seeds. And some Baylight Spirits, and two energies, holy. There we go, that was a nice P7, wasn't it? Huge. Oh wait, uh, <clears throat> huge. Not P7, for a Crystal Triskelion, let's go. Huge day, guys, look at that, a third of an elite clue from a seven minute boss fight, awesome. Surely, go go, yay! That's a PB, nice! That's a 3.6 second PB in duo. Sub 7.30 as well, very nice. Oh, it's worth zero drops, apparently. <laughs> Good, yeah, nice. <laughs> it happens, it happens. But yeah, really good kill to I'm very happy with that. We, uh, we smashed it. Ever wants to mage prey while being a ranger, you know? Like, like no one has ever wanted to be on the wrong prayer for their combat style. Could this kill change the game forever? Uh, no. <laughs> no, it can't, but, uh, yeah, that's like a fraction of a tectonic helm repair kit, so that's cool. There we go again, one more kill. <laughs> yeah, that's why Ring of Death is rather good if you are TL5 at Rago. Definitely, uh, give it a go if you haven't already. It's very, very useful. And if anybody was wondering, the, uh, you know, the, the bleed does still clear on phase change despite Monday's update. They uh, did not fix it, so uh, we can keep going. Virago, and oh, look at that. Great job to finish. The Bane Spirits and some Tectonic Energy. That's what we're talking about. Big, big, big money. <laughs> but yeah, so I started using a few Ascension keys, just some sexy keys, and uh, no groups there. But I think I'll try like get everything down to like 200 of each, and then soon we'll actually have a threshold as well, which is quite exciting. Uh oh, okay, <laughs> a little monster in there. That's a, a thou. Oh no! Oh, I messed up, guys. I messed up. Help! But yeah, a thousand legios have been uh, have been slain, which is pretty nice. All right, so that key there takes us down to uh, like two hundred of everything overall, which uh, I, I guess is fine. Uh, no drops in those kills, but we are at over a thousand kills now, though. Um, so yeah, I need to do like a hundred more, ideally split very evenly between all the pets, uh, all the bosses rather, and uh, yeah, that should get us to a threshold. So the Legia pets, I was, I was off by a hundred. Um, but it's fine, that shouldn't be too bad either. Just use a few keys at every boss and we'll get to 1200, no problem. And then as soon as you get a boss pet, um, you just completely send it uh, with all your keys that you have with that particular pet. And then, good luck. Pick it. Oh, hello. Look at that. First signet. It is a sexy signet as well, so we'll grab that. Um, not that I actually need it. I've actually got the most of these ones, but uh, maybe not for long. We'll see. There we go. Who's a good secundus? Oh, no way, dude. We got our first pet. Let's go. All right, we're sending it. We're sending it to secundus. Very nice. Dude, that's before a threshold as well. Let's go. That is a full send. Oh man, that's so good to get one out of the way early because now I can use all of my Secundus keys and just like get a threshold. Oh, that's so good. I get 200 kills just for, for free now, basically, because I've got that. That's so good. Literally bang on drop breaks that they're one in a thousand. So that's literally completely, uh, completely you know, average. So I'm not a spoon, believe it or not, but it, it's so nice that I can just use all these now. Oh, look at that. We got another Signet as well. 
think we might be getting quite a few of these in the uh, the near future now that we can just spam secundas, but that's uh, pretty cool. Oh nice, that lead you there was actually uh, 1100, so yeah, 100 more secundas, uh, and then we can uh, maybe start on the other ones. Uh, potentially just probably spread them out again so we get one of the other beds. And this will get us a threshold, and then after that I'll probably use like like 25 at a time on each until we get one of the pets, if we do happen to get one. And then obviously send it with that key completely, and then do the same again with the rest. So yeah guys, probably the biggest thing that I've been working on for a long time on my, uh, my account here, my Iron Man, is of course the Cripploom Helm. And man, I am so <laughs> unbelievably relieved that we have it. Um... In terms of like KC and like luck for the drop log, um, it's like around average, I think. Um, I think, think the average to get the drop log is somewhere around like 13 to 1400. Um, so we're we are about average. Um, however, obviously, um, that could that could be ending the drop log on anything. So, uh, you know, <laughs> it would have been nice to have full crypt earlier, but uh, I'm so so glad that I have it now. You know, I, I would much rather have ended on like a, a spore sack or a, even a book or a torch or anything. Um, but very unbelievably glad to have that done. And uh, yeah, as you saw earlier at Zami, we only did one hour of Zami today, but we got all four kills, which was fantastic. And uh, even though some of them were a little bit messy, that was very much a me issue. Slight bit of rust, uh, but that's all good. But man... Fungal shield in P7, high in rage. My God, my God, it's a game changer. It's it's like it's it's. I I don't know how to explain it. It's like a, it's like a, a guardian angel. It's incredible. Like it tanks like five thousand damage for you, and that's basically an entire auto attack. So what that means is you can keep your HP lower because you've got like a secret five K shield, which means you get. The pad 6 buff, which the order that I do the edicts gives me 30% more damage. So I can have that for longer while also having to not eat food, which drains my adrenaline, and not drink brews, which drains my stats. So basically, I get to do more damage. Which also means I get to do more healing via soul split because I'm doing more damage while soul splitting. So it's like, even though it, yeah, it is a 5k shield, it's probably effectively closer to a 6k shield. Um, but man, I oh dude, we we are gonna send it. We are gonna send it in the uh, the coming days, coming weeks. Um, because I would love to get 4K, and I am so hyped for it now, so so hyped. So cannot wait for that. Like this is literally like it's literally like the same as the hammer, like the stat hammer from uh from revs. Like it's same kind of uh importance, and honestly, arguably more important. Um. But yeah, I am so, so happy we have it. And uh, yeah, no more crow ever again. Oh, that's a good thing to say, isn't it? Great thing to say. That boss, some of the decisions they made in that boss are just mistakes. <laughs> like, mainly the loot system. Uh, the fact you would, like, wait around for ages um, in order to get more points to get more loot. I think that's really stupid and should have been changed way at the beginning. But uh, it didn't, so it is what it is. Uh, yeah, other than that though, uh, they had Legio pets, as we said, we're going to start using keys, uh, which is pretty cool. And yeah, we're going to start sending some, uh, well, send the, the entire Secundus now. So yeah, the plan is to uh, do all my Secundus keys, and then uh, just uh, do like 20 of each of the rest of the keys, then do 20 more. And then if I get if I happen to get any of those pets, then I'll just send all of those keys, because um, you've got to be very efficient with your key usage on Iron Man. I want to spread them out very evenly until you get a pet. Um, just to try and utilize the maximum thresholds you can. So that should be fun. And then a uh, Rex Mate Truck update. Been doing this for a, a few hours now, actually. We're 1700, so this uh, wouldn't be surprised if this pet were to uh, come soon. Um, I can't remember if it's 1 in 1k or 1 in 2k right now. No, oh, sorry, 1 in 1k or 1 in 500 right now. I forget the drop rate of these things. Uh, it might be 1 in 1k with one threshold. Um, I really can't remember, but. Uh, Either what I did do is I got my second uh, complete spear just now, which is kind of cool. Got the shaft, so uh, that's lovely. Um, and yeah, other than that, uh, obviously Calfight King is uh, you're still not being very friendly for the pet, but it is what it is. Got the drop block though, so that's all good. So you just need KK pet. Um, I will also be finishing off 
Vindicta at some point, the 100 hard mode, but it's just, I don't know, it's it's pain. <laughs> Challenge mode Vindicta, it's pain. And of course, the Twin Furies, the other pet is still missing as well, but I've got one of the two. Um, but yeah, and then after after Cover King, we will most definitely be heading to QBD. Uh, we've got quite a nice cool time. We're actually 25 seconds, not bad, right? Not bad, not bad. But yeah, we'll be uh, having a good go with that. Um, but only on Slayer Task for QBD. It seems almost silly to not. Same with the Cover King. Um, but yeah, things are going well. And then, of course, uh, Virago, Scott Plus Week for well, one more day. So, you know, maybe we'll get lucky. But uh, yeah, definitely no normal mode next week. Normal mode is terrible on the Vitalis Week. Uh, but hard mode, though, that's, uh, that's a different question because hard mode is actually very good on Vitalis Week, believe it or not. Sounds crazy, but it's true. And uh, yeah, we will see how all that goes. But for now, thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to come to the Twitch streams. And uh, yeah, hopefully you're uh, about as happy as I am to see the Crypt Bloom Helm and uh, the soon-to-be Zemi pushing. So uh, see you guys soon.